as a company, we've been around for a long, long time, since 1876. We have been part of building fixed networks around the world. We've been a major force in bringing mobile telephony to 4 billion people. The, the mobile phone is actually more common in the world than a toothbrush. That's worth <laughs> thinking about. It's what is happening now in these times. These times are a bit special. We see an economic decline. We see difficulties in many ways. But we also see our industry going through dramatic and very exciting change. We are converging the, the mobile and, and fixed businesses. And we are converging telephony and internet. And, and that opens for a lot of opportunities. I remember one of my discussions with Eric Smith at Google when he said that you can divide the world in two groups. Those that understand that the internet is the answer to everything and those that have yet not understood that. And I think we have partly understood that. And, and if you want to be part of a converging IP-based networks, fixed and mobile, if you want to be part of an internet world, we have to be based in Silicon Valley. And this was very important to us. And that is why we started to build up our presence here through acquisitions. And, and uh, it may not be in this very quickly changing industry that, that in every place we are in the world that we have always increasing number of employees because there are activities that disappear and others are being built. I think this is a place that we will grow. We have also had a pretty fantastic run in North America over the last years. We were 4,000 people here, if you go back three years. We are now 14,000. That is to be compared to the, that is by the way, I think about as many as Google have in North America. So we're not small here. We have, that is to be compared also to the 18,000 that we have in Sweden, which is our home turf. So North America has become an epicenter of, of Ericsson of importance. Uh, and Silicon Valley is forever an epicenter within North America. We're very happy to be here and happy to be part of San Jose and the development.